Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will talk about the method of data storytelling. If you are a data analyst, business analyst, or you are in a team of management and you want to showcase the dashboard, how to present a dashboard to the management or the leadership team. This is the objective of this video to explain you the method. Right. So first of all, if you have created a dashboard on Power BI or Tableau or any other BI tool, then you have to understand you must have added five to seven visuals, maybe pie chart, donut chart, then bar chart, column chart, stack chart, then heat maps, five to seven data cards you'll, you'll be adding in that apart from visuals. Then how to start from where to start. This is very important. So in this video, I will show you from top to bottom, like how to go, how to proceed. So let's get started. As you can see, this is the company dashboard where on the top left side, you can see the revenue data card where I'm seeing the revenue as $8,17,860. What is my monthly breakup? You can see here in the tooltip. So this is my month wise for the year 2021 you can see from january till december what is my sales now coming to the number of pizzas sold so number of pizzas sold are 49574 and number of orders for these sold pizzas are 21350 so the contribution of this is maximum from the evening session you can see there are four sessions evening afternoon night and morning in the evening you can see out of 21,350 you can see there are total 8,446 orders in the afternoon it was 8,145 orders in at the night there are number of orders as 4,498 and finally the least in the morning that is 261 orders now if we check the number of categories we have four categories you can see in the donut chart here as well, there are classic, supreme, veggie, chicken. So if I see the most sales is coming from classic category, that is 30% contribution. If I talk about the second contributor is supreme, which is contributing 24% of my business. Third is veggie, that is 23% contribution. And finally, chicken is contributing 22%. All right. Now, if we check the pizza types, there are 32 pizza which we are providing to our customers. Out of them, there are 96 pizzas with different different varieties. For example, if we are giving one Thai chicken pizza, it can be in medium, it can be in large, it can be in small size. So by that definition, we have 96 varieties of pizzas. And the average order value of each order that customer is taking, it is $38.31. Now, if we want to check the orders at every hour, like how my number of orders are increasing or decreasing on year hour to hour basis, then you can see in this graph, you can see from 10 a.m. till 11 p.m. how my bar chart is growing or degrowing. You can see in at 12 the number of orders are 2212 at 1 pm it is 2686 at 2 pm it is 1836 so you can see this time of the day is very nice for the company right here at 1 pm the maximum number of orders were taken that is 2686 so this is our afternoon session as we saw and finally in the evening session you can see these three are green like 5 p.m., 6 p.m., 7 p.m., also 8 p.m. slightly. So you can see this evening time is the maximum contributor for our business. Now, if we would like to see which are the busiest times for us for each and every weekday, for example, from Monday to Sunday, at what time we are busiest and what time we are vacant so that we can plan the things accordingly. So from this graph, you can see that. So from left hand side, you can see these are the name of the weekdays. Top headers, there are from 10 a.m. to 
11 pm as depicted for each column now if we have to see for let's say friday you will see the first row at 10 am there is no one coming in 11 am roughly 48 then 12 pm 344 1 pm is busiest at friday on friday rather for all the weekdays so 1 pm you can see the maximum 2686 while second best looks like 6 pm that is 2409 third best is 7 pm 2238 so this is how you can see like 1 pm 6 pm these are the busiest times also if you have to check this for particular weekday let's say for uh, monday which is my busiest time here also i can see the busiest time is 393 with the immediate busy time as 12 pm for 379 and now if i have to check for tuesday for tuesday again i can see the busiest time is 1 pm 437 and for 12 pm it is 339 and if we go towards evening we can see the majority of the orders are coming at the time of 6 pm and 7 pm right the darker the cell the more orders we are getting right and if we are moving towards the night around 9 pm and then 10 pm the orders are really less and then if we come towards 11 pm at night the orders are 189 in total for the whole week right so you can see for us the critical time is 6 pm 7 pm 5 pm and in afternoons it is roughly around 12 pm 1 pm so we have to strategize so that we can plan things and we can cater to more orders during these times all right now if we have to check which are my top three pizzas and bottom three pizzas on the basis of revenue we can see these data cards or rather we can say these are the tables where i can see top three pizzas are the thai chicken pizza the california chicken pizza and barbecue chicken pizza these three are my top contributor on the basis of revenue and the bottom three are the brie car pizza the green garden pizza and the spinach supreme pizza you can see the contribution is somewhere around 11,000 13,000 15,000 dollars for each pizza in the bottom three in top three you can see on an average it's roughly around 41,000 dollars right so now from this dashboard you can see which are my top three pizzas bottom three pizzas how many categories do we have number of pizza types that we are catering what is my average order value number of pizza sold number of orders then which is the busiest time of the day then uh, orders by the sessions and number of orders for each hour so overall you can see holistically how the business is doing we can see the revenue as well i hope this video was useful to you if you want to have more videos similar to these content then do let me know in the comment below thanks a lot for watching this video guys